Israeli military officials themselves have admitted that this goal that Netanyahu has set to eliminate Hamas is impossible uh, because they know that Hamas is not just an organizational structure, it is an idea and every Palestinian is absolutely united in getting rid of the Zionist occupiers from every inch of their land in occupied Palestine. And we have seen over the last, not just one year, but 76 years that the Palestinians have been resisting the Zionist occupiers and they cannot be defeated. An idea cannot be defeated. And so in that sense, it is an impossible task that the Zionists have set for themselves, but now they have got trapped in their own rhetoric. And so they don't know how to get out of it. If, for instance, they accept a ceasefire, then this would be interpreted as an open defeat for the Zionists. Hamas is not going to surrender. Hamas is not going to come out with a white flag and say, we gave up, because Hamas is fighting for their fundamental inalienable right that is the right of all people in the world to a life of freedom, dignity, and honor. And so for that, they are prepared to struggle as long as it takes in order to achieve their objectives. And I can clearly see that the Zionists will not achieve their objectives. They keep on expanding the war as they have now done against Hezbollah in Lebanon, but they're not going to succeed. Ultimately, it will be the Zionists that will be the losers. We also see that literally tens of thousands of Israelis are fleeing the country because they see no future for themselves in that illegitimate entity anymore.